about to die. Malavai, heal me. Malavai. Yeah. Oh, heal yourself, yeah. Expected that to be a difficult fight. Right. Five out of twenty done. Just need to find that holocron. Then I'll be out of here before you can say flabadoopa kika poofa shigabakuba. If you understood that. You know why I said faster than you can say that? Because I doubt you can say it. Know how I was man how know how I managed to say it? Because I made it up on the spot. You're frozen in time! No! I'll save you! Oh no! Bugger! Yeah, Malava, you uh. You're keeping busy, okay? Keep it busy. I'm just I'm nearly there. I'm just attacking this guy now. And he's a bit of a tickle to your tongue. You know, going and I did it again. It just leaves a bit of a tickle. Uh oh, there's another one coming. I can't deal with two Jedi Knights. Oh good, he's walking the other way. Thank goodness for that. Go and you have something for me. Thank you very much. And we'll go. Oh, I kind of have to attack that Jedi. Um, should I wait until it comes to me to make things easier? Yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I was about to take a drink then. Then it started walking towards me. And leap. Perfect. Uh, and leap. Come on, I thought I'd kill twenty by now. No, don't you dare unlock. And there we 
there we oh there's always a there's always one more ah there's always one more didn't lose you how far away is it really God's sake so far away ah I've got to escape the cave yet yeah. Uh oh, Jedi's coming this way. No! Stay away, Jedi! Stay away! Stay away, you je- Oh! Ah. Stop joining in the battles. This is their battle. Let them have some honor of blood. Stop stealing the limelight. There we go. And now you're dead. Ha Right, uh little further to go. Wonder if I I got I got a sneak ability. Um if I put you away somehow. Dismiss. There out. we go. Can I sneak by you guys? I'm gonna try that. Yes! That was awesome! I snuck by them. <laughs> that was awesome. I need to do that more often. Lead the way. I do hope the uh, smuggler video will go be up on Thursday because I'm going to set it up to upload on Thursday, but it might not upload for you guys until the Friday. Um, it's like the very first episode of season two. I set it to upload on the Saturday night, but it didn't upload until the Sunday morning. So um, yeah, I do apologise if it's not up on Thursday, but. You know, for, for the United States, it was up on Thursday, like two hours before it turned Friday. So, uh, I guess that counts. I guess. Now, I have to make my way out somehow. Um. And the thing is, I, I've got a couple of other quests to do, and I don't really want to... I take my leave. Come on, come on. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. See, I need to do that more often. Oh, great. Let's see if I can sneak around you. Whoa! No, keep away from me. I didn't do anything to you. No! No! Leave me alone! I'm innocent! Summon him! Ah! I'm just running. Run, 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 run. Sneak. Come on. I can do this. I can survive. Come on. Survive. I'm so close. I'm so close to freedom. Yes! Yes! I survived! Oh my god, I survived! Holy heck! Lead the way. 
That was funny. Can't Let's believe I survived that. That was amazing. Right here. Gotta go on this path again. Because we've got to find... And I've got to go to the Duran Mountains. It's snowing! Yay! Hooray for snow! Do you know, somebody should do a parody video of the life of a in-game character. Because you know, you know how some people just sort of leave your characters in the snow and then, you know, they go to the toilet or something. Well, what about, like, a short video where you can see your character literally freezing and, you know, you they want to move so badly, but, you know, you're going to be at the toilet for a long time or something. You know, the poor in-game characters which are just left in the cold while you go for a pee break. <sighs> oh, a probe droid. Oh. Your Republic probe droid. Ooh. Ooh, it's a windmill. I like windmills. And we are here. Hooray! We made it. Is this my terminal? Yes, it is. We made it! Jump. Vehicle pads are currently open for business. Are they really? Uh, let's bind myself to here. Perfect. Oh, excuse me. Let's hand in some quests. For a second there, I thought that was, um... Uh, what's his name? Uh, oh, how the main guy in Sith Warrior, uh, Sith Playthrough, uh, Republic. What's his name? Um, how can I forget his name? He's like Stanol Fu. Uh, I was told you want to see me. Yes, Moff Sarek said you'd be here. We've had an inspection team lost to the Killix for days now. Darth Malgus! They were inspecting one of our mining sites for lanthanide deposits. But in the middle of their inspection, the entire place was overrun by Killix. We've had no communication for days. Who's that? Some other noble house? Killix are the native aliens here. Giant bugs with just enough brains to hold a blaster. Moff Sarek wants this team back. Apparently, some of them hold serious rank off-world, but the rest of House Thule is balking. Attacking these Killicks would take half our army, but apparently, I'm too close to the problem to strategically assess its value. No Sith would fear a mere bug. If you help, House Thule will be in your debt, and I will commend you to Moff Sarek, whatever you want me to say. It's not only the inspection team. My daughter is in there too. I don't know if she's alive or dead. If you can find her, find our advisors, free them if they're prisoners, I promise you a reward that will leave me bankrupt. I will huh. not let these aliens kill your daughter or the advisors. Thank you. For myself, even more than for my house. Ah, experience points. Yay. Hello, Lord Erdun. Lord Erdun, Agent Vickers said you'd be interested in this holocron. The holocron? Yes. Jedi maid, gatekeeper intact. Even predates House Thule's exile from Alderaan. Perfect. Perfect. Jedi were foolish to hide these secrets from the Sith. Thanks to you, they now belong to the Empire. <laughs> so what's my prize? Ooh. Ooh. What's in this box? Better be something nice. Oh. It's nothing nice. I must murder you for not giving me anything nice. Wish I could. The Holocron holds many secrets. Actually, I don't, but never mind. Soon, What's that? They will be the Empire's. What's this? Oh, shuttle to the Imperial Fleet. Ah, this is probably going to be a. Ah, it's a flashpoint courier. Let's see what Darth. Uh, Darth. Uh, have I. How, seriously, Darth Malgus. How can I forget his name so quickly? 
Identity confirmed. Protocol 7 activating. Come on. Attach Holonet news footage. Forward from Darth Malgus. Message title Opportunity. Report timestamp and begin playback. Original Holonet transmission source. Cadimu system. Timestamp minus six standard hours. So only six hours ago. The Republic can trust Kadamimu 5 with missile stockpiles, but not financial support. The Senate asked me to prepare this world for war, then calls me corrupt. My fellow Kadamimus, you have suffered these political games long enough. My duty as governor is to protect you, so as of today, I am declaring independence of the Republic and declaring its weapons our own. Darth Malgus requests strike team assembly. Mission response to Academy of Five Secession. The fools abandon the Republic and make themselves vulnerable to us. SOM1 not designed for situational analysis. Recommendation rendezvous with Dark Ma Darth Malgus. I'm going to rendezvous, eh? Travel to the Imperial Fleet. Well, I don't want to do that quest yet. So, eh. Um. Yeah, I don't want to do that quest yet. Let's get rid of that. Now. Um, right. Where am I going? I'm going down here. Yes. Looks that way. I'll be done soon anyway. Lag should be occurring anytime soon, sadly. I probably just jinxed myself, but it will. Come on, let's face it. Uh, where am I going then? I I'm going to the main quest, I see. About time. <laughs> and I can promise you now knock, knock is the main quest. I swear on my life with that one. Oh, it's a pretty place. I like it. It's so pretty. But I bet it's Republican. I bet it's going to be a crime for me to be there. See? It's like soldiers there. They're not doing a very good job keeping me out, are they? No, they are not. Seriously, I just walked by their defences. Like, what? Um, that's where I've got to go. Wait, where? Um, where have I got to go? Ah, it's over there. Okay, uh, how am I gonna... How am I gonna do this then? I wanna sneak by them. Again. Let's, let's dismiss you. My lord. Sneaky, sneaky! Um... Anyone up here? No? Oh, okay. That's fine by me. Um, right, now somehow I've got to get over there. I've got to get in there. I see. Haha! -ha! Oh. That's a shame. Oh well. I'm here as solid. Wah! 
Easy peasy. Good one, Malamai. You're doing something right. There we go. Pick up some loot. Nothing over there. Okay. And time to open the elevator. Level 2. I'm not level 2. I'm level 31. Oh, ah. Dead. You know, I'm tempted to make you guys comment to something. I just had a thought in my mind. I should say something, and then I want to see how many of you guys will actually comment it. And I only want you guys to comment it once, alright? I don't want you to. Just, I don't want, like, one person to spam, like, the comments section with this quote ten times. Um, just do it the once. But why don't you quote? Um, Malavai the healing idiot. Just quote that. Might as well. Go ahead. Malavai the healing idiot. Confront. Confront. My Windred. Lady. We have intruder. Intruders. I seek the family of your former handmaiden, Jasa Wilson. What's this nonsense you're spouting? I don't know what you're talking about. Lady, let me kill this Sith like the last one Duke Kendo sent. Windred, you don't need my permission to kill an enemy that comes barging through my door. Make it fast. I'll make it fast. Let me save you the trouble. This Sith faster than last one. You will not win this day. You can't see me! You can't see me! I've really got to use that ability more often. That is really helpful. I mean, did you see that? He went and attacked Malavai when he couldn't see me. I've got to do that more often. I really do. <laughs> Easy. I sorry. <laughs> this can't be. Um I I'm sorry I ordered him to kill you, Sid. I hope you don't hold it against me. You see, I've been fending off Duke Kendo's advances for some time, and I just assumed you were here for him. If you're not working for the Duke, I I'll gladly cooperate. You you mentioned um, a girl, yes? Jace or someone? Glad to see I have your undivided attention. You have a very persuasive manner. I was aware of the young handmaiden who left Alderaan with the Jedi Master. And I did hear the name Jason Wilson, but you're mistaken. I didn't know her. The girl never served me. Lying to me would be a very big mistake. Duke Kendo will be able to discover if she's lying. The Duke congratulates you on your impressive venture into House Alde. I'm here to take the fair lady to him. No! Don't let him take me to that... that pig! I do know who the girl worked for. I'll tell you all I can. If only you'll keep me from Duke Kendo. Don't leave anything out. All right. I'm going to trust that you'll be honorable. Before she left with the Jedi, Jaso Wilson was the handmaiden of Giselle Organa of House Organa. They were inseparable. Before the war, Giselle was an aristocrat like myself. Now she leads the Organan troops against House Olgo. Where exactly is this Giselle Organa? Her headquarters are somewhere on the front line. The Duke will know where to find Giselle Organa, and how to reach her. 
If you let me deliver Lady Renata to him, I'm sure Kendo will happily shed light on the situation for you. Um... I'm afraid I'm forced to hand you over to Kendo. I thought by telling you what I know, you'd show mercy! Your destiny lies with the Duke, woman. Be nice to him, and maybe he'll treat you well. I meant what I said. I'm sure Kendo can help you find and confront Giselle. You should consult with him on it. Be sure he's prepared when I get there. Of course, friend. I will see you at House Thule. Come, Renata. Time to face your fate. And a terrible fate it will be. Well, might be good. Might not be all that bad. Oh great, now I've got to find my way out of here. Really? Apparently I'm running at 60 frames. Blimey. That's surprising. Now I'm back to 30. In that brief moment, you caught what it was like to run at 60 frames per second. Oh, there's a bunch of enemies there. And they can kill me. Uh, but that's not what I'm going to do. I'm going to go here. Actually, no, I'm going to return to the Duke because I'll just leave that other quest, the hive mind, for another time. <sighs> we'll hand this quest in and then we'll be done for the day. Or the night. I might actually do hive mind uh, off screen. You don't really need me to see. You don't really need to see me do that quest, do you? Not really. Oh, you're over there. <laughs> well, okay. You be like that then. Hello. Knock, knock! I'm home! Ah, you return! I'm beside myself with appreciation for delivering Lady Renata for me. She will prove to be most useful. Anything for House Thor. <laughs> you will forever be cherished here. Oh, thank you. So, Fimres tells me the lead was fruitful. Although Lady Renata was not the gold's mistress, she knew who was Giselle Organa. I should say, General Giselle Organa. Ooh. Now you have to track her down, which poses a bit of a problem. I haven't met a problem my lightsaber can't solve. Well, let's discover a way to put it to use here, eh? Giselle Organa leads the Organa War against House Ulgo. Her headquarters is protected by an impenetrable force field. No firepower can breach it. The force field allows Giselle and her advisors to be stationed very close to the front and maintain a more hands-on command. There's got to be a way to penetrate the force field. Well, that is the task that faces us. Wait. Yes. A force field needs power to maintain itself, yes? So, if we manage to cut the power, and I bet I know exactly where Giselle is getting her juice, if I'm right, you could just walk through the front door. Sounds very promising. Almost all the power on Alderaan is supplied by the planetary generator. Giselle must be piggybacking the system to power her force field. Several of my fellows do this to maintain their special security needs. A precise charge at the generator will force fail-safes to fire. The planet won't miss a beat, but ancillary systems like Giselle's force field will have to be manually reset, which could take some time. So they'll be defenseless. And I bang my way inside while the force field is down. Smart. Precisely. It is infallible. Fimres, 
Fetch a seven-stroke seven detonator from my arms cabinet there, and give it to our friend. As you wish. Did you the older need power to speak is located like above this? The Valley, and it boasts the planet's most advanced security systems. You'll have to fight your way in, set the charge, then fight your way out before the boom. It won't be easy. Consider me warned. Once you've detonated the generator, you'll still have to wade through Giselle's surrounding army and invade her headquarters before her force field is reset. I'll be eagerly tracking your progress. Good luck. Thank you. Ooh, um, ooh, that will come in handy. I'm going to take that from you. Uh, and I'm going to wear it. Lovely jubbly. Um, so that will be it for the time being, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, so look out for my smuggler playthrough uh, very soon. I've already recorded it, as I said, so you'll be looking into the past. Um, so thank you for watching, guys. And I will see you next time. And what have you got to say, Malavi? I'll be right here if needed, my lord. He'll be right there. Yes, he will. He'll be right there, people. Farewell!